Hello, Darby Ward. Welcome to the Clothes Show Diary Room. Thank you. Yay. Um, are you having fun at the Clothes Show in association with Alcatel today? Yeah, it's been really good. I've really enjoyed it. And have you been to the Clothes Show before? No, this is my first time. Everybody always talks about it and I've never been, so I'm really, I'm really excited to come. And what have you been up to today? Um, I performed today and yesterday. The crowd's been really good. It's been nice. You've been bit, I'm just, I'm totally bedazzled by your eye makeup. It's so divine, so glittery, <laughs> shimmery. Do you know what? I've done this myself as well. Have you? Yeah. Singer come makeup artist. I know, I can't believe it. No, I've just been copying my makeup artist. She's really good. So she, I made her give me a few lessons and yeah. It's incredible. I'm like, <laughs> can you just do some on me? Get your palette out. Let's get cracking. <laughs> um, so what have you been singing today? Um, I did a couple of covers and then I did some new songs that hopefully are going to be on release next year. So yeah, Exciting. it's been really good to show what I've been doing. That's so cool. And the clothes show is moving to Liverpool next year. Um, how do you feel about this? I know. Well, obviously, it's only my first time here, so I've really, really enjoyed it here. But Liverpool's closer to me, so I'm actually quite happy for that. <laughs> All about the moving yeah. to the north, isn't yes. it? Yes. Yes. And Liverpool is beautiful, so I think it'll be really good. I know. I've got my rollers in already. <laughs> um, when it comes to your personal style and how you dress, um, talk to me about things that you love. I mean, these thigh-high boots. Ooh. I kind of want to whip them off and take them home myself. Yeah. Talk to me about your style. So um, I love like edgy, easy to wear, like the kind of clothes that I could wear here, but then I could go out or just, you know, I'd rather be cool, casual and, and feel comfortable in what I'm wearing and yeah. have a bit of like sassy but classy kind of, yeah. I'm obsessed with that, <laughs> sassy but classy. I don't think I've ever been described as classy, so I'll, <laughs> that's going on my Instagram bio immediately. <laughs> When you go on a night out or you go to a birthday party, what kind of look do you go for? Um, I don't know. It depends, really. Sometimes I like a bit of fun, like a tiny bit like underdress, like long boots, t-shirt dress, funky hair, always good makeup and good hair. That is like well, key I mean, to the proof is in the pudding right here. <laughs> and then, oh, sometimes I like to go like quite dressy and smart and super sexy and sleek. Depends, yes, depends obsessed. On the um, it's, now, we are on the run-up to Christmas. What is Christmas like in your household? Do you stay in a onesie? Do you get glammed up? Christmas is crazy because <laughs> I've got two little sisters as well um, and there's loads of us. So sometimes we have onesie days and oh, actually last Christmas we had a onesie. We got my granddad onesies, everyone. I love um, granddad in a yeah, onesie. And we did a massive um, Instagram photo of like Christmas with the wards and there was about 40 of us in onesies. But then the year before, we all got dressed up and went to the pub, so it depends. <laughs> I, think we, I think we're doing Christmas jumpers this year, actually. Oh, yeah. that's it. Have you got yours already? Yeah, my mum sorted it all out. All done, all yeah, sorted. I'm an elf. I don't want to be an elf. I'm a green one. I'd rather be a red one. I'll take the elf. <laughs> Is there room for one more? Do I'll come down. Great. Sorted. Done. <laughs> um, have you done much shopping today? I have, actually. I've had a good look around the stores. Um, I've got a really lovely, like, fur hat and things like that that mm. they do and then I've got some great eyelashes well. well these are amazing yeah. as well there's Actually loads the of same, lashes here the same place yeah amazing <laughs> I saw the stand I was like oh I need to go <laughs> um, now in terms of your music what would be your dream dream gig oh I don't know you know um, my dream gig probably be like of the Glastonbury or somewhere like that like a really really good amazing outdoor festival I love outdoor shows that's my favorite things that I've done so far I enjoy dancing outside actually come to mention yeah. it um, <laughs> and who would be your dream celebrity to duet with oh mm, probably Chris Aguilera Yes. yes, enjoying that reference massively. Mm. Um, now, we like to do a quick fire round. This okay. is my diary room, it's my rules. Oh so <laughs> leave any, leave any prohibitions at the door, please. Cast them aside oh, and answer go. me whatever comes into your head first. I okay? apologize already, okay. It's fine, not a problem. <laughs> Cheese of choice. Cheddar. How many tattoos do you have? Zero. Um, give me your highest note and your lowest note. What now? Like, bah. Oh. Ah. Oh. Pretty low, pretty <laughs> decent. What's your sandwich filling of choice? Ham. Um, TV or radio? TV. Automatic or manual? Automatic, easy. Towie or made in Chelsea? Uh, oh, made in Chelsea. Heels or trainers? Mm, that's so hard. Heels. You have to give me an answer. Heels. Um, Strictly or X Factor? X Factor. Poker straight or curls? Curls. And finally, Joey Essex or Jamie Lang? Oh, 
Don't like. Yes, good choice. <laughs> <laughs> I like his little videos on Instagram. That's why I'm he like, is oh, a funny. Yeah. Darby Ward, you've been absolutely <laughs> sensational. Thank you for joining me in the diary room. Thank you. See you next time. Bye. Bye.